I have uh, figured out a couple of improvements, made some, some innovations to the, uh, the model that I posted instructions to. And um, this makes it possible for you to construct this without a glue gun. And it's also more secure. So I have taken first a half gallon plastic jug and I cut the butt of it and the top of it. And then in the butt, I placed a, uh, I cut a hole exactly the size of the spout. And these will click together really nicely and um, be a very secure way to hold your netting. Um, I don't have netting for the demo. I'm just using a coffee filter to kind of take the place of the netting. Um, but you could just buy some screen, like a nice roll of screen, seven foot by three foot is like six, six dollars. So anyway, I have this, this is symbolizing the netting. You wrap that over the spout and then you press the spout and netting into the butt of the jug and you get this satisfying click. Now we have a completely secure uh, housing for the netting. Um, the next innovation that I made was um, instead of using another half gallon jug like this, I used a slightly smaller, um, this is a one liter, and the great thing about this is that if you push them together, um, they lock. And it's really, uh, there's really no way for a bug to get up around and escape um, that way. So the last step here is just to take a zip tie and put your bag and, and zip tie tightly to the smaller spout. And then you've got yourself a pretty bug proof tree. Um, the other thing I just would add is to make sure that your netting goes all the way around the base of the tree. So make sure that you measure the, the part of the tree that you want the netting to go around. And that's it. I'm gonna be making a few more of these now that I finally figured out something that works and that I don't have to use a glue gun for. <laughs> Happy hunting.